What happens if a person jumps into water from a height? They say that if you jump from 35 feet into a pool that's only 4 feet deep, you're guaranteed to die on impact. But if you toss a mattress in first, it's supposedly safe to jump. But can a mattress really absorb that kind of impact? To find out, the team found a pool that was exactly 4 feet deep and brought in a 180-pound crash dummy. To measure the force of the impact, they installed a G-sensor right where the dummy's heart would be. Then they hoisted it 35 feet into the air. For the first test, they dropped the dummy in a seated position. As soon as the release pin was pulled, the dummy fell straight into the pool, sending up a massive splash before slamming into the bottom. The sensor showed a 50G impact at the surface and 29 Gs when it hit the bottom. Next, they floated a mattress on the water. Would that soften the landing? Adam released the dummy again. This time, it smacked into the mattress with a thunderous nice. thud. The sensor recorded an 86G impact, the equivalent of a severe car crash. Clearly, the mattress didn't cushion anything. It actually made the situation even worse. So what kind of injuries would a real person suffer? Adam wanted a result you could see. If a real human jumped from that height, what would actually happen?